guys welcome back to another episode of C programming tutorial in today's episode we are going to uh, learn about a loop called a while loop a while loop is a useful component whenever you need to execute a statement or a block of statement in, in a number of times that means uh, if you want to cycle a statement or a group of statements in your programs uh, for example if you want to print numbers from 1 to 100 then it is not possible to uh, write print of statements into 100 times to print numbers from 1 to 100 that means you can use a single print of statement and repeat that statement into 100 times to print up to print out uh, numbers from 1, one to 100 so uh, in C programming there are a lot of loop statements are available uh, to perform such cyclic execution of statement or block of statements a while loop is one of most important one it's a very useful loop so this is the syntax of while loop there is, uh, you can use do while you can use for loop etc for performing the same functionalities okay all these loops are uh, similar but there is some slight difference among them so here we are we are going to learn the first cycle loop cyclic uh, loop in pro in C programming called uh, the while loop here is the uh, condition here is the syntax of a uh, symbol while loop so this is the keyword while and you need to open this bracket and here is a you need to provide a boolean condition so this is the body of the while loop like if loop if there is only one statement is available one statement is with this while loop then you can avoid these brackets if there is more than one statement is with this while loop then definitely put all that statement within these brackets okay so the working is very simple uh, first it to check compiler check the condition if it is true one then it will execute the statement okay there is one more statement here uh, update statement okay so based upon the update statement that means this may be an increment or decrement statement the increment some values or decrement some values here that is called the update statement okay uh, at the first time if the condition is found to be a true one uh, this block of statement will execute and update a value again it will check for this condition for true or false if it is again found to be a true one again execute this block again check the condition again secure if whenever the condition is found to be a false one then this loop will exit and execute the next statement coming after the uh, ending bracket of this loop okay this is the simple working of an uh, while loop in C programming okay I will explain it with a complete, a complete working example so I open up my ITE here is a program okay here I'm going to write a simple program to print a numbers from 0 to up to n so here I declare a variable in the I Uh, int n and ask the user to how much numbers you need to print so using print of statement print of enter the limits enter the limit just ask the user to enter a limit okay save it into variable n so use scan of function can of some integer value so use the format string percentage d and you need to use the address operator ampersand operator and save it into variable n okay so now I am going to print numbers from 0 to n 0 up to n so just simply start a while loop while uh, also I declare another variable here it is i and i initialize i from 0 i initialize the variable i from 0 so here i check the condition while the value of i less than or equal to n this is the condition 
and I open the bracket for this loop and here I print it, print it, print off, print off uh, put a new line I equal to here I need an integer value so I put percentage D and use comma operator now provide the value here the value is I okay now I increment the value of I by 1 I plus plus means I increment the value of I by 1 that means I plus plus is also equal to I equal to I plus 1 these two statements are same so this is a simple program I save it I save the program now compile it okay compilation is success so now I run it so it asks for a limit I provide limit as 5 enter here we got the output i is equal to 0 to i up to 5 so we can check how this will work so here when I, when I run the program I provide 5 for value 5 for the variable n so here on this statement the value of n is 5 okay now initialize i with the variable 0 value 0 so here it check first uh, it is 0 less than 5 so this is found to be true 0 is less than 5 so again enter into this loop and enter into this loop and go to a new line and print i equal to 0 that is now the value of i is 0 so we got the output see we got the first line i equal to 0 okay uh, now it will increment the value of i i plus plus that means now the value of i become 1 so here again check the condition so here the value of i is 1 again check 1 less than 5 again it, it found to be true again enter into this loop body and print i equal to 1 again increment the value of i into 2 now check again again it is found to be true and print i equal to 2 now increment i become 3 so this will repeat up to i equal to 5 whenever the value of i is 5 here you can see that this condition is again true that means uh, the equal to operator this one this one is this condition is less than or equal that means any of these condition may satisfy so here again it is true now print the value of i equal to 5 now i plus plus means i is 6 so here the condition is value of i is 6 now the condition is false one this one is false so the loop body will exit that means it exit here and it will turn 0 this is how uh, this is a working of a simple while loop in C programming guys I hope you enjoy this video try it yourself with your own examples and please subscribe now my channel for getting more video updates Thank you for watching. See you in the next part.